Hi there. We're continuing our progress through the Psalms, the Tehillim, that means the praises in Hebrew, and we're in Psalm 133 today. That's in the Hebrew letter numbering system. That's Psalm Kuf, Lamed, Gimel. Kuf is 100, Lamed is 30, and Gimel is 3, so that's 133. This is the 14th of the 15 Shirei Mamalod, the songs of ascent, the song sung going up to Jerusalem. And this is a wonderful song of togetherness, a song of unity, a song that would probably was sung nearing Jerusalem and being in Jerusalem and being together, the togetherness of the people of Israel called together by God. And so the opening lines are, Hine ma tavu ma naim shevet achim gam yachad. Look how wonderful it is, uh, how good it is when, pe when brothers, uh, when people come together in oneness. Uh, the word gam yachad is uh, from, uh, similar to the Hebrew word echad that means one. And so it's this oneness, this unity, not uniformity, not everyone being the same because it's an amazing variety. But when we're together in that togetherness, in that unity, just as God is together in unity in himself. And uh, so it says, Hine manaim, how sweet it is, how pleasant it is. And then it goes on, Kashem tov ala rosh yored, ala zakan zakan aharon. It's like the oil that was poured on the head uh, flowed down on the beard, the beard of Aaron. Looking back to the outpouring of God, the, the, the anointing of God on the priesthood of Israel, the priesthood that was ministering in God's presence in Jerusalem in the times that they were going up and so looking back to that anointing of God upon people particularly upon the the, the, the priests in this case flowing down and not just uh, uh, on his beard but that goes down right to the edges of his garments it goes down to the collar as it says in the old version of his robes the fringe the hem of his garments and then he goes on and says like the dew of Hermon coming down on the hills of Zion. And of course, they were geographically a long way apart. Hermon is the highest mountain uh, in, Isra in Israel. It's right up in the north um, and, and often is continuing snow capped. It's the source, the source water for the River Jordan. The, the, in fact, it's interesting. This, this psalm uses the word Yored quite a lot that is going down. And the name of the, the, the river that comes down, the Yarden, it means the, the one that goes down, the one that descends. And so here it is, this, this water flowing down like the dew of Hermon coming and falling on the hills of Jerusalem. Well, actually, Jerusalem, Zion, is in quite a dry place in, uh, and uh, is surrounded by hills. Um, but it's like it's, when the Lord is present, it's like the dew of Hermon, that refreshing dew falling on a dry place, falling on Zion itself, on the place where God comes. And of course, later in Ezekiel 47, and also at the end of the scriptures in Revelation, it talks about the river flowing down from the throne of God and seeing Zion as being the, the throne of God. And then uh, at the, the last line is, Kisham because there God commands blessing. Chayim ad haolam, life unlimited life without end, life everlasting. Uh, what a beautiful, beautiful song this is, a song of unity, a song of the joy that we have when we come together uh, in God, when we come together with God as God's people. I'm going to do something unusual in this. I'm going to sing this, uh, my own setting of it. Um, starts off slow and gets faster. Hine ma tov, O ma naim, Shevet achim, Shevet achim gam yachad. Kashe mena tov, Ala rosh yoreh, Allah zakan zakan aharon she yoved al pi midotav et al chemon she yoved el haretzion ki sham zibad onay adabacha chayim adaolam et al Shall you read the Lord's 
שם ציווה אדוני את הברכה חיים עד העולם. הנה מה טוב ומה נעים שבט אחים, שבט אחים גם יחד. כשמן הטוב על הראש יורד על הזקן, זקן אהרון שיורד על פי מידותיו, כטל חרמון שיורד אל הר עציון, כי שם סביבה אדוני את הברכה חיים על העולם, כטל חרמון שיורד אל הר עציון, כי שם סביבה אדוני את הברכה חיים Have a good day.